Hello, I am Chloe, and this is a video how to make your own eggs if you don't know how. First, of course, you need a pan where your kitchen is. So you get a pan, put it under, right where the fire is, so it doesn't blow up, and so it like doesn't go up there or there, and it needs to go under. So then down here, if you can't really see, that you see off different kinds. And I need to press it in, then turn it until I hear that clip sound. Turn it all the way, because that's how I do it. I put my hand here to see if it's getting hot. Then when I say it's hot enough, I open up the sun like usual. I press it. I press it down. Then I put that to the side for now. Open it and get an egg. Tell me which kind of egg sh I should do. I'm going to do one of my favorite kinds. One yolk. And there's one rule I'm going to say. You must um, listen like how much eggs you can use. Like my mom's rule is I can only use three eggs. <laughs> wow. So now I'm, now here's one of the tricky things but kind of easy to me. You crack your egg, you take where the yolk thing is, and you open it and make sure you don't get the yolk in. You only get the Okay, you see, it's very easy. And last egg. I might, hey, what are you doing? Close that. <laughs> Cracking it again, another egg that's pretty tricky. You open it, you get, and make sure you don't get any shells in, because that won't be good. So like this. Then over here, come over here. The most important part, you get wherever your sink is, you open it, you wash your hands, you turn the sink off, you get a towel, then your hands are all clean. Yeah, I gotta throw that in the garbage. And now, over here, I get a spatula. Yeah, not this kind. This kind. And I make sure it's not burning. Because once, every time I'm saying, this is a little story, every time I go to my grandma and grandpa's house, they make it burn. But the trick is I figured out why. They're not shaking the edge. And you know what? My my grandma never flips the eggs. Yeah, I don't think I am allowed to. Cause then I'll mess up the pretty yolk. The pretty yolk. I don't like no messing up my yolk. Oh, you see? Look at that! It's already getting kind of burned. Yeah. So. Yeah. And the most important part, like what I was saying, under here. Like, if you go like this, the fire gets under, you see? So we want to put it right on, on the low. I keep it on low, come on. So like, down here, it says low. If you can't really see, it says low. And yes, if you're noticing, I am wearing my Le Mans uniform. If you go to Le Mans, Hit the subscribe button. Wait, what is this? Now this is the part I do not like my sister does. And this is the tricky part. Cause if you had a yolk, you do not want it to get messed up. But you kind of want to get all that jiggly stuff to the side. Now this is the tricky part. Okay. I'm just scooting it to 
the side. And so I'm just saying I would let it cook a little bit. So when I'm letting it cook, I'm gonna right now go over here. Open my cabinet. The drawer of plates. I took my plate out. Yeah, no. I want a fancy plate. I'm picking this. Take my plate. Is it good? Okay. Now I'll keep my plate here on the counter. I'll keep checking on the eggs. Okay. You see? You know what I was talking about. Don't add a lot of pan spray. And if you don't, um, and now the opposite question. If you don't add any pan spray, your eggs won't stick. So that's why I add a little bit so it can go like this. Like you can move it. Like. That's what I mean by that. And like, if she, I'm just saying. Wait, are these almost ready? <gasps> no, that's just funny one. Okay, yeah, I'm done. So I'm gonna turn my spine and go, it's done. I take it by the hand, so then I'll go like this. This is my way to do it. Does these look good? Look at those. Look, eat some. Take a bite. But they're my eggs still. Okay, I did that. And now, I carry my plate over here. Drop it right there. I don't mean drop it before. I mean, like, place it down. I still looking at these. These need to have a little time alone. Okay, now I'm gonna get my fork. And then I'm gonna use a knife. Yeah. I'll show you next Okay, now, if you don't know how to cut your eggs, this is how you do it. I'm going like this. Sometimes I go like this, I just like getting my yolk. But then there's the hard part of the yolk, which I throw away in the garbage. So you see, like, at the end of the yolk, there's like this hard part. My sister likes, but I don't. And so like, it's just, I don't like it. I don't know why, I kind of want to like it. I try it so many times and I'm like, ew, what is that? Okay, so I got it out. Don't you see what it looks like? It's like hard. Bring my um, thing over right here. Throw it in the garbage. I need to get another napkin because I don't want it to stick to me because it's like yellow. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, yeah. Now, how to cut your own eggs. You keep your fork right here. The knife is in, like, I think behind or in front. And then, and so you go like this, and each place, you make sure it's cut. And I'm just saying, you can be a little messy and use your fingers. I would, I do that sometimes. Yeah, but I don't really do it anymore because I like, I figured it's something out. And it's like gross. You can cut your eggs any way you like. If you make scrambled, the same process. Take how many eggs, crack them in, Crack them in, crack them in. Get your spatula, mix, mix, mix. Or crack them into a bowl. Mix, mix, mix. Pour it in, keep mixing. Okay. I'm gonna keep working on this, but you can go if you want. Bye bye.